Nyla, a French siren sculpted from macarons and moonlight, sashayed down the cobbled streets of Lyon. Her laughter, a melody of clinking champagne flutes, spilled from beneath a jaunty beret perched atop her cascading raven curls. Unlike the stick figures adorning magazine covers, Nyla's curves were a map of laughter lines etched by degustations and whispered secrets shared in hidden bistros, each one a story whispered in the scent of ripe camembert. Tourists gawked, cameras clicked, but Nyla's gaze danced with the Rhone River, a silver ribbon reflecting the city's ancient charm. She wasn't just a model, she was lion personified a passionate tango of clinking glasses and bustling boochins and the rhythmic clatter of silk looms in hidden workshops. Her laughter, a secret shared with the wind, carried her to a boulangerie tucked away like a forgotten Monet. Inside, Monsieur Pierre, a baker with flower-dusted dreams, winked at her. He knew Nyla's secret, the model who craved not couture, but buttery croissants and whispered poems under starlit bridges. And as Nyla savored the flaky, golden perfection, Lion sighed, knowing it had found its muse, not just on the glossy pages, but in the unashamed curves of her smile, etched with the stories of her vibrant, sun-kissed city.